All new at 6, spring is a great time to explore the Columbia River Gorge, whether you hike or you bike or simply drive through it. But on this morning's Andy's Adventures, Andy tries a truly unique way to see the gorge in a biplane. Oh, I'm so excited today. We are going on Jim's biplane rides. This is Jim. There's the biplane. And this is not your first day, right? Tell me no, that. No, I've been doing it for 30 years now. Okay, 30 years and no problems. You're still standing. No, We're everybody's good to go. made it back 100%. Okay, good. We're going to keep that streak alive. So tell me a little bit about this. It's airplane. a 1929 travel air built in Wichita, Kansas, US made. I was built in Wichita, Kansas. How many of these are still around today? There's, they built nearly 1,200 of them, and there's probably 75 to 100 that are left flying. When we go up in the plane, is it is it bumpy? Is it smooth? It's very stable. Okay. It, it, it's called high lift, high drag. So it, it's not very fast. It was made to carry a bunch of weight and get off the ground quickly. Are we going to keep it level, or are we going to no, do the turn? Any of the views are to the side. You don't see much straight, straight ahead. Uh huh. Um, the dirty side always stays down, but we'll go by my rides go by <laughs> crown the dirty point. Dirty side always stays down. Yeah, I've never had it upside down. Uh -huh. it, it's capable of aerobatics. It was an air show airplane in '39. Well, I fly in the gorge because of the scenery. Right. I'm limited to 25 miles, and that's the Bridge of the Gods. That's an hour-long flight. That's the most popular flight, the ones okay. I do the most of because it's the best deal. Over Bonneville Dam, Bridge, Bridge of the Gods, there's like 60-some waterfalls in the gorge. Should we give it a go? All right, let's all right, do it. Let's do it. You're I sit back here in the right back pack where all the instruments are. Uh-huh. Which controls. does it, it seem real advanced. It, it, Will there be snacks? <laughs> no, there's no snacks no on snacks. this ride. Just a great view. Then I have helmets and goggles to keep the wind out of your hair and your eyes. I can see your control panels in the sky. I'm ready. Let's do this thing. What elevation will we be and I fly down low, it's slow, but uh, down to 500 feet. The highest I get is 2,000 or maybe a little bit more. some of the different things that we will see when we go through the gorge. Well, the waterfalls, like Multnomah Falls is a half hour ride, and there's several waterfalls there, Mist Falls and Wakina Falls all beside each other. And there's Beacon Rock for the upriver. Then all the fire damage from the Eagle Creek Fire 2017. That is unbelievable. Yeah, yeah. It was, yeah, it was re really fun. It was gorgeous. Cool. And and Jim, as he said, has been doing this for 30 years, wow. and uh, he just goes out there. And so Mike Heinrich was up in that front seat with me. So right it's big enough you. for two oh, people, wow. as long as you're not too big. Sure. But yeah, yeah, two people, and then he's in the back. And then Michael Ober was at uh, the uh, Crown Point uh, oh, uh, to right. get the other yeah. shots out there. So, so I have a question for you, because it looks so beautiful. It looks so peaceful the way it's put together. But when you're in it, is it really loud? You've got earplugs. Okay. Uh, yeah. And so it, it muffles it. But yeah. there's no way, there's no verbal communication with the pilot. Right. So it's just kind of like your... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, were you ever concerned, not just because of the age of the vehicle, but just like, you know, just the being up there flying like that? Yeah. Is it ever scary um, at all? With it, no lid. It, right, no lid. <laughs> the pilot's behind you, not, not in front yeah. of you. And that's, and that's where those planes are yeah. set up with the pilots right. back there. We had a seatbelt, and mm -hmm. um, the uh, the thing to me that was amazing is I've been on commercial flights that were bumpier. Oh, yeah, right. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So it goes up, and it just, there was a, just a little bit, and then wow. you just kind of go along, God. and uh, yeah. Uh, he was super super knowledgeable really nice yeah. and he does different lengths of uh, trips yeah. he wants you to be at least four years old <laughs> <laughs> yeah because he said do you remember anything before four no <laughs> yeah, yeah, the just, wasted experience just, yeah, if you did that, that you might yeah, but, yeah, yeah. exactly yeah. Oh, really so neat adventure, anyway we yeah. have a link on our website kptv.com it goes to his facebook page and it has all the information nice. but yeah. i mean he is the uh, pilot um and he's the one that answers the phone when you wow. call if you want to get in there and he takes he puts your luggage on uh, he does <laughs> he does everything out awesome. there so yeah yeah, really great. great, great it was fun. Yeah, yeah, it was fun to do. I'm nice. um, glad you liked it. Let's go to that.